Okay, so nice little short video for you today. Obviously, content's content. Um, yeah, we're going to go save a couple of Hondas today from the scrapyard. Now, I'll go into a bit more details later about what we're picking up and why we're picking it up. So fortunately for me, uh, I borrowed Looney's uh, Civic the uh, other weekend for around seven of time attack. And uh, that means I brought the car and the trailer back here. Now I've put the car into storage at home, which means I've got the trailer stored here. So since we've got two trailers and two cars to pick up, we've decided to do it in one sweep today uh, and get them both picked up at the same time. Now, not far to go, only Hull. So a good day traffic, maybe an hour and 45 minutes. Uh, but yeah, Ash and Tom are gonna be here in a minute. They're gonna take Looney's trailer. Then we're gonna get loaded up and uh, yeah. We're going to go pick these Hondas up. There we go, we're now on the road. We've got both vans loaded with the trailers and we're on our way to a sunny Hull on this lovely Sunday morning. You can see you've got Tom there in the mirror with a doblo. We'll give a trailer on. So yeah, we need to get some fuel. So we're gonna make it about 20 miles down the road and uh, fuel up. And I think while I'm there, we're gonna tank it. So we've got enough fuel for Snetterton in a couple of weeks' time. <laughs> so we've made it to uh, Sunny Hull and uh, we're at uh, Mr. Chewy's Chinese. But fortunately, they're not open because I could go for a chicken chow mein or two. But here we are, here are the cars that we are rescuing. So what we have here is another Honda Shuttle. Now, we've just discovered that Ash actually used to own this one. So uh, the fact that it's coming back to us is uh, a bit of a laugh. Fact, yeah, it is. I do, I do remember that sticker on it. And then this is the three-door hatch, also known as purple in the uh, the old fourth gen circles. Now, the shell doesn't look too bad. It does need some sills and uh, it definitely needs something doing the roof. Now, luckily on the old red, um, we'll go into a bit of discussion on the old Binley Civic in a bit. Uh, but yeah, the roof on that one's still good, so hopefully we'll get Lydia to come down and skin it So we can get rid of this fuckery on the roof So uh, yeah Now as you can see they've got no front suspension on but I have made a couple of little dollies that I'm going to bolt in lieu of the front subframe So what we need to do is we'll get Tom to reverse his trailer in first And then I'm going to back my trailer up to it because mine's got a winch on it and then we're going to winch 
that one up onto the trailer. I'll move my trailer out of the way. Tom will then pull that out of the way. Then I'll get the trailer up on this one and uh, get this one yanked up on the trailer. So yeah, it's going to be a bit of a mission, uh, but hopefully it shouldn't take us too long to get these loaded. You don't know what's pissed on that sofa. <laughs> Living his oh, best life. I'm homeless Steve and welcome to my crib. Start locking now, Dina. Start locking it. Yeah, keep coming. No, 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 hold on, hold on. Yeah, keep coming up that. So that was actually pretty painless. Discovered that the, the rear trailing arms aren't bolted on, half the rear trailing arm setup is missing. Uh, but it's on, and uh, my little dollies have worked a treat. That's held them on just nice. So we'll get this one strapped down, get this one pulled out, and we'll reposition the trailer in front of the shuttle, and then it's basically the, the, the same process with that as it was with this. Oh shit! It's the JDM guy. How are you doing, fam? How you doing? Yeah. So I'm not doing commentary, I'm going to put a bit of voiceover on this one. So yeah, that was um, a successful extraction. They went on a trailer a lot easier than I thought they would do. Now, I had sort of pre-planned for this. Um, I was aware they had no front suspension at all. So what I did is I fabricated two suspension dollies uh, with some big massive pneumatic casters on and then they bolted in place at the front subframe which was missing on both cars. So okay, so I bolt them to the chassis legs drop the front down, roll them on a trailer. Now, Marcus was under the impression that they still had some rear suspension which allowed them to roll, which the wagon did, um, but the, the hatchback, the trailing arms, I weren't even bolted to the chassis and we had no bolts. So we've done what we, we can do with that. But yeah, as you can see, we're just uh, trolling through the Lincolnshire Wolds right now, on the way back to the workshop. I think the plan is we're going to take both these cars round to Ash's workshop 
and we're, we're going to get some TFR and we're going to give them a nice pressure wash. Obviously, they've been sat where we picked them up from for a long time now, five or six years. So, as well as all the tree grime, um, obviously, there's a lot of bird look on there, which is obviously quite hazardous to touch. Um, obviously, we're not planning to work on these cars straight away. It was just we needed to pick them up today, otherwise they got scrapped. So that was really the push to get them collected today. And then, uh, yeah, once we've got them washed and cleaned down, we'll go park them down the side of the workshop, ready for when we need to utilise both of these vehicles. So yeah, see you at the workshop. So there we go, all back and uh, safe and sound at the workshop. Unfortunately, I got back a bit too late because I went and picked up uh, a gearbox um, after we picked these cars up. So, but uh, Ash and Tom have uh, got the purple hatchback all cleaned up. Now, I'm not going to tell you why we've got these. Um, I'm going to go over that in a separate video. Um, separate video of why we're, we've got the hatchback and a separate video of why I've picked up this uh, this Honda Civic Shuttle. So yeah, look out for those videos on the YouTube balls in the next couple of weeks. Uh, but yeah, nice little Sunday drive out. Um, I forgot quite how close Hull was, an hour and a half each way, which isn't too bad from here. Um, so yeah, with that being said, I want to go home and enjoy the remainder of my Sunday. I might even try and get this video uploaded the same day and on the YouTube balls this uh, this evening. We'll see. So yeah, with that being said, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you in a future video. And uh, don't forget to tell your nan about the two scrap cars that I've just picked up. She's going to love it. <laughs>